Meghan Markle was set up for an incredible amount of abuse as the first mixed-race member of the royal family, an American actress has said. Dene Benton said the system was not set up to support the Duchess of Sussex. She added that former Sooth star Meghan, who tied the knot with Prince Harry in 2018, was set up for an incredible amount of abuse. Ms. Benton told Tatler magazine, It's such a layered conversation, obviously dot being the first and only, you're really set up for an incredible amount of abuse, the system isn't set up to support you. And I think that, because of, the lineage of the really profoundly devastating effects of colonization as it relates to the monarchy, you can't necessarily just pop a black person in. Dot she added, it requires a lot of reckoning. Dot unless you're ready to do that work, then the person who's put in that position ends up suffering more than the changes they are able to make. It's going to take much more than one person coming in to trigger all of that change. Dot it doesn't really work. They just get eaten alive or make the choice to protect themselves and, in the latter case, im like, power to you, sis. Meghan married Harry in a spectacular winter ceremony in May 2018. The couple, who met in July 2016, had announced their engagement in November 2017 following a whirlwind romance. However, less than two years on from their royal wedding, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex announced Megxit plans. They wanted a half-and-half-out -half arrangement but the idea was rejected by the Queen. Harry and Meghan officially ended royal duties in March 2020. They are now pursuing new lives of personal and financial freedom across the pond. They have set up home in California with their two children Archie and Lilibet. Meghan opened up about her royal struggles in her and Harry's explosive Oprah Winfrey interview in March 2021. She claimed an unnamed member of the royal family, not the Queen or Prince Philip, made a racist comment about her son Archie before he was born.